Thank you for coming back to our show. Uh, I, I'm so excited that you're here. Uh, and I just read some amazing things about you all, true. Uh, and there was more stuff I wanted to talk about. Uh, you, I didn't know, you, had, you have an Oscar nomination for Best yes. Original Song. Yes. You're the first woman to be nominated for a Producer of the Year Grammy. Yes. You have 27 top 10 hits. Yes. <laughs> you have the record for most consecutive top 10 hits on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100 chart by a female artist. And you're the first and only artist in history to have seven top five hits from one album. You are unbelievable. Yeah. You're iconic. Just to tell you some nice things about you. Well, is, it, you. is it embarrassing? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, I, I want to talk about so many things. Uh, uh, Control was your first uh, number one album. Yes. Uh, before that, you were more like into acting and, and doing that. But what what made that album different? What do you remember about that album? Oh gosh, that was me coming into adulthood, yeah. um, um, being a kid, a teenager, going to Minneapolis, being with Jimmy and Terry, and oh, yeah, Jimmy Jam, Jimmy Jam, and Terry Lewis. Yes, absolutely. What yeah. would you guys get into over there in oh. Minneapolis? <laughs> <laughs> I, I was I was very sheltered, and I, I went to Minneapolis with a friend, a school friend, and um, a good kid, good kid, didn't get into much trouble. Okay. But uh, I had my moments, or they gave me my moments, I should say. <laughs> How did they give you your moments? Uh, the, 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 you know, the drinking age, I think, is 18, 19 in Minneapolis. So we went out one night, and, and uh, they gave me some ice cream. I think it's called Brandy Alexander ice cream. Wow. Well, it had a lot of brandy in it. <laughs> really? Yes, and I, I, uh, I got messed up. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 you know, I never had a serious drink until I was 23. Is that right? Yeah. So Did you get any work done that night? Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, it didn't work out. No. Not a good thing to do at all. No. Do you have a favorite line or a favorite lyric? Is there one lyric that everyone always just... Set, yells to you? Or? Oh, gosh. D D Miss, Miss Jackson, if you're nasty. Yeah, that's right. Okay. It has to be, right? It has to be. <laughs> I, I get it from everybody. Miss right? Jackson! <laughs> it is iconic. That is a great line. I get it from everyone. Really? It doesn't... It, it, entertainers. Everyone. The, everyone. Did you realize it was going to become iconic when you... When you no, I mean you're just you're just creating music. You you know no, I, I never did, and and the story is crazy. What was the story? I, I, once again in Minneapolis, and uh, my friend and I we were we were on our way. I'd never taken a dance class, so she had this great idea to to take a dance class. We were staying downtown at a hotel at a loft, and um, walking out of the hotel, there were like five or six older guys up against the you know standing up against the wall and. And they just basically started messing with us, oh, and cat calling us. Yeah, and I, I I didn't like it very much, and mm. I was pretty embarrassed, and I was actually pretty upset. And I came back to the studio that night and told Jimmy and Terry about my experience, and it turned into the song Nasty. Wow, yeah. that is a crazy story. Yeah, because my first name ain't Baby. It's Janet. Miss Jackson, it's the nasty. Yeah. <laughs> it's the best. Uh, we asked uh, your number one fan in the world, Questlove. <laughs> uh, I was wondering if he has any questions for you that he would like to ask you. Uh, Quest, do you have any questions you would like to ask? Yeah, I always, I always wanted to know, for years you wore a key in your earring, uh, I guess for your animal cages or whatever, but yes. where is that key? Like, what, what happened to it? I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's in storage, in my storage. Wait, what? So what is this? What, what, why would you wear a key? I, I never kept a, a, what, what, a key chain? the keychain, so, uh, and I took care of the animals. We had so many animals growing up. Really? Uh, and that was your job? Yeah, we had fawn, mufalon, sheep, um, peacocks, uh, giraffe, uh, just all kinds of animals. No, that's just, no, it's totally relatable. Every kid had that. <laughs> So it was my job to feed them, to clean them, to clean the cages. That was my, my, you know, my chores. So this is a working key? That's a working key. <laughs> That's amazing. That's a good question, Quest. I like that. I never knew that. So all through school, I, I, wore, hooped, I wore hooped earrings. Yeah. And, and I would keep the, the key on my earring so I wouldn't lose it. Uh, any other questions, Quest? Yeah, in the Miss You Much video, you do that uh, 
that dancing with the chair and, and the hat yes. that lands on your foot. Yes. How many takes did that take for? Oh, gosh. <laughs> well, you know, it's really funny that you asked me that because we, we shot, I don't know how many days, because that was the long form video that we were shooting for Rhythm Nation. And I, I think we shot maybe two, two three days for, for, for Miss You Much. But that, I think, was like the second day of shooting, and it was the 23rd hour, something like that, of oh, shooting. Gosh. And we were so delirious. They brought breakfast. Day was break. We were eating pancakes. We were laughing like crazy. And then suddenly, we had to do this routine. So uh, it didn't take many takes to, to obviously in rehearsal you get it right. But we, we had some mishaps.